so by now we are very much uh, familiar with the uh, uh, like the importance of wash within the cholera and particularly ipc but why we wanted to bring ipc in in this discussion so you know the the importance of IP, ipc infection prevention and control it has been there for a long time but during the covid time it has got much more importance and has also the alignment with cholera or any other infection prevention control so with that thought we uh, wanted to bring this to this forum that if we really want to move uh, also include uh, ipc within the wash working group and have some idea or some uh, work within next one year so with that note uh, in the background we want to say the importance of uh, ipc to protect the people to protect the community from the vulnerability of uh, different infections and also the importance of wash particularly the running water safe sanitation environmental cleaning process waste management and uh, hand washing options uh, that is the more pronounced within the uh, all behaviors in the uh, ipc so that how we integrate ipc within the wash and uh, particularly cholera control and prevention so this is the background that we thought to share with you and uh, we also want to bring this ipc pillar uh, within the uh, wash cluster uh, discussion to prevent the uh, cholera so uh, in this work plan at least uh, we thought of this activity for next uh, uh, one year like ensure that wash response to cholera outbreaks is part of the ipc agenda at least we advocate or we bring this agenda within the uh, broader cholera discussion in outbreak management and also establishment of a wash working group under the ipc pillar like wash fit in ipc and ipc fit in wash within the purview of cholera prevention and management so with this um, idea we've thought that there are some challenges like limited visibility for wash in public health emergency and cholera that we all are very much aware of limited governance from multi-sectoral outbreak response so I, ipc so far in many cases ignored or not uh, given the due importance at the national subnational and regional level and there is a cluster system only covering part of the countries regularly affected by cholera outbreaks so within the national cholera control plan within the outbreak management of cholera there is not due importance or due inclusion of ipc agenda within the uh, broader management plan so and also ipc and wash actors activities can be siloed like there are examples of this changing in malawi we have the uh, example that uh, it has been given the due importance and also they are working together so um, with that uh, op um, challenges we also think that there are some opportunities particularly within the covid time interest from the ipc sector at who to integrate wash especially for cholera readiness and response so with the knowledge of ipc the uh, the uh, newer uh, uh, technology the newer knowledge we can include and integrate wash within the cholera program response and plan and regional regional cholera platforms already linking health and wash so we can also think of that to um, link the data the management and in uh, reflect them in the national cholera control plan those who are coming up and uh, making the implementation plan and also in alignment with the uh, advocacy efforts for um, strengthening governance and during the outbreak response and wash situation so with that note we had the brief idea and background to share with you to get your uh, uh, in, in inputs and uh, insights and uh, um, very group uh, like uh, some other work plan uh, we uh, water right and unicef had this idea and looking also uh, uh, if there is any other uh, organization or any other people interested from this um, audience or even participants online so then we can together discuss and also think of how we can move it forward so we welcome any other person interested or any other organization have similar interest or, or to work on ipc and uh, wash within the uh, cholera so this is very brief presentation and the idea sharing from our subgroup thank you